His mom, please. I, I choose one. Perfume, mama, candle. Uta paka candle kongo. Why you got the, the milkshake? How I rate your tamuka milkshake? If you don't like extra milk, vanilla. And, uh, if you're one of the people who has been uh, through stress, depression, don't feel ashamed of yourself. Don't don't feel like you're out of the world or, or it's abnormal. No, just find treatment. Don't let it also escalate to the point that it's out of hand. Don't do anything to harm yourself. Don't self-harm. Um, just find a way. I Hello, buddies. How are you guys? Welcome back to my channel. I've been gone for a minute, but um, as usual, life was just lifing, and um, I was a bit unwell. Um, my mind has not been uh, at anything in particular. Let me just say the truth. I was depressed at one point, but uh, I thank God I'm healing, I'm getting better and uh, i'm back right now um i'll tell you more about the topic as we keep on uh, doing this so we're just passing the nairobi expressway i'm with my daughter oh, yeah though she he whipped <laughs> i'm with my daughter over here um I'm taking her for breakfast at her favorite breakfast place. It's a mommy daughter date today. And uh, they just closed school, so. And she's alone because my son has traveled uh, on a school trip. And so she wanted something we can do alone, just like the girls. So come with me as we enjoy the day and bond. And. Um, I'll show you a nice hidden gem also where you can go for breakfast with a, on a date with your person or with your daughter even, yeah. So see you when you get there, guys. So at this point, I was just coming through town looking for parking in case you are in town and you don't have parking. Um, you can always DM me, I tell you where you can get good parking that is safe and uh, not at a very bad rate, at a, not a bad rate. And then we went, this is where we were going to eat. This is where my daughter loves to eat breakfast. Uh, we, were, we were just getting into the parking on the underground. Yeah, you know what happens when you get in such buildings. So. Well, that's where we went second floor broadwalk mall up there you see how beautiful the place is and this is the restaurant inside i'm sure that was hurried so that's just me my daughter was my videographer for the day that's where we were we didn't stay for long food was brought on the table uh, there is the food my food was brought i just i had i hadn't taken breakfast uh, i asked for a black coffee and a chicken wrap it came with a side of salad. Yep. I don't want to disturb your eating. Mm. 
and I don't want you to feel some type of way. You see, you can eat elegantly. Yeah, I can no, eat. me, I don't know how to eat elegantly. Nice. I just eat. Mm. But it's nice. Mm. It's nicely spicy. And the size is just perfect. You know, I don't like inviting. Mm. So out of ten. Mm. What is the name of the restaurant that I ordered this? Tomoka. Tomoka. Mm -hmm. Tomoka. Tomoka. Mm. Tomoka restaurant rating for my chicken wrap and my coffee. Do I say give it a nine or a ten? It depends on you. Mm. They're both they're both still high ratings. Because even the timing is not bad. They put it in a good time. Mm. They put it in good time. The food is delicious. I just don't like these papers unless they are cooked in a different way. <coughs> That's the only problem. And it's not even a problem. <laughs> That's a big problem. Mm -hmm. It's a personal issue. Mm -hmm. So like a 10? Mm -hmm. I think a 10. For 9.5. 9.5 for Marco restaurant at Broadwalk Mall, second floor. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm. It's okay, they'll bring me another. I'm trying to help it out. Hmm? Help it out. No, they'll bring me No problem. A fork. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Definitely, I don't like bananas. <laughs> but you're the one who asked. Thank you. The other one dropped. Okay, no. Yeah. Hmm? I'll give it back. I think a ten. A ten. Mm -hmm. How is that? That um, the dough part mm -hmm. of the waffle. Is it soft? No, I don't want. It is too sweet. I'm I'm taking something spicy. It will spoil my <laughs> balance. Yeah, the balance in my mouth. <laughs> it's um. Eh? It's, it's, it's well done. It's well done. It's soft. It's not hard. It's hard on the outside, but soft on the inside. Soft on the inside. Mm. Um, the milkshake is also from Jamaica. Uh, the milkshake, how I rate your Tomoka milkshake. If you don't like extra milk and vanilla, mm -hmm. you don't take it, but personally I like milk. I but you can milk. also take and tell them how much milk you want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Personally I can see. Mm. But I think I like it. There's a lot of milk inside and I like milk. You like milk? I rate your food as a whole. Yeah, no, no, no. I'll be hungry in the next three hours. Three hours. So it's not really a heavy thing. It's not a heavy thing. Mm -hmm. But you've taken a, a takeaway. The other one you ordered. We'll, we'll request for a different one. Okay. Mm -hmm.
Yeah, if you don't have it, you don't have it. But not the waffles, because if you take the waffles, it's just funny. If it's not fresh? It's not, yeah, if you don't have it immediately. With? Immediately. Mm. Mm. So what will you order next? A wrap. Mm. Like a... Oh, it's a bit spicy. Mm -hmm. mm. I don't want that. You don't want spice? Right. Mm. Yeah, spice. Mm. I don't make a rating spoon. Oh, whole meal in, in general is up. 9.5. Wow, that, that's nice. I think mostly because, you know, yesterday my stomach was hurting and I'm here eating sweet things. Mm. But I hope it won't hurt again. Mm. I hope she can. But the fruit is fresh. Mm. Mm. The fruits are fresh. Mm. Mm -hmm. So at this point of my journey, I was just thinking about um, how far I've come. Um, as I was eating there, I was just celebrating to the fact that I could be able to go to such a place with my daughter. I could be able to treat her. And and um, as I was told, I was telling you, my journey has been very tough as an individual. I'm not saying any other person's journey is any lighter than mine, but uh, you can see like I was really actually reflecting on where I have been. The mental uh, illness, the way it had uh, been to me, and how far I've come in terms of healing. There was a time even just going outside like this, I was I couldn't be able to like. So this is something I was just reflecting on and thanking God and just like celebrating life in short. But um, if you're someone who suffers from mental illness, just try and. Um, encourage yourself do the things you love to do spend time with your loved ones that is part of the healing process uh, and then yeah you'll get better uh, if you can afford to take yourself places where your heart feels happy to be there and don't take life too serious no one will ever come out alone with life so just take life a day at a time if in a day you are able to even like wake up, even uh, just look presentable, and just even make a meal, then we thank God and we keep on trying because, um, and then there is no one who will, who will be there like to do it for you. Like the sad part about this life is you have to do it alone eventually. At this point, we got into the supermarket down there at Broadwalk Mall. There's an Ivers, so we were just shopping a bit, and they didn't want us to record. So my daughter was just being extra careful about the recording thing. As you can see, we couldn't just like record, yeah. So at this point, I, I was just walking in the supermarket, you know how it is, and seeing whatever was missing. And the people over there didn't want me to record, but me, I had to get some content for you guys. So make sure you like and subscribe, people. And I was trying to avoid people being in my view, because, you know, when, when you do that, that's when it becomes off. I picked some natural yogurt over there. I love taking that when I'm hungry in the evenings. I don't like eating meals. I normally do some natural yogurt and some sweetened yogurt. A lot of natural yogurt. It helps me because uh, it fills me up in the late evenings. Because I'm someone who works over the night. Over the night, 
So you find it's four, it's even three o'clock in the morning, and that's when I start feeling hungry. So instead of eating a whole meal before I go to bed, I try and avoid it. I eat either grapes, fruits, if I have any fruits, and I also eat uh, yogurt. So in case it's late and you, you feel hungry, this natural yogurt is normally nice, especially if you mix it with the, the flavored one. But a little bit of the flavored because of the sugar amount. And it fills you up. And then if you feel hungry again, you can have some fruit. Yeah. Instead of going to bed on a full stomach, you know. the chicken that was a score uh, some scones I was buying because I was asking my daughter if they would eat it because I don't like buying without confirming I only took one because I'm not sure if they like it then I went for bread that and I was sure they would eat it. They love bread. And you guys, how, like, Vito is my own guest at Come on, Zim Cat. Economy, oh, you must wait. Watch out. So, this, this, these are the ones I was talking about. I wonder how they are kept, like, for long without getting spoiled. And then I came with it. I put one on the lower part of my fridge and the other one on the upper part. And I went to the upper part and it was not frozen. Is it the packaging or what? They don't freeze? Or what? I don't understand. <laughs> I think it's the packaging. Yeah. I was just picking vegetables over there and comparing with uh, my local supermarket. I was thinking how their veggies are more fresh. Then I ended up comparing their danias. Their danias are not as fresh as the ones at my local supermarket. Like in this life, I realized like there's something always better somewhere and, and vice versa. So this is the place where you come for regional bath and body works. The ones you get in the US. See at in Zile Bonokoza. River Road. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. So do easy. They smell really good. This one smells a bit like Carolina Herrera. Or a perfume that I've had in the past. Yeah, I bought this because I love the lotion. And then this is my baby girls. And then this one. So when you, you meet me, this is mine. Uh -huh. So when you meet me, lol. <laughs> I was... Don't be shocked when you, when you smell me. Yeah. Yeah. And their prices are great. I'll tell you how much I'll be charged at the end of the day for all this stuff. Yeah. But I've just decided to try and spoil myself, self care things and all that. They even have those, they're called. Those are candles. No, they're called what? This is a Panamuli shine. Mm? Yeah. What is that? When you go to the beach and you want your body to glow, you put this. Yeah. Yeah. Events. So if you like your skin glowing, your body not, not in face sana sana. This is what you shine, shine. They also have candles. I love candles. They also have candles, scented candles, bedroom candles, sitting room candles. I love it's candles. It's just that I'm not a fan of candles. But I am a big Either fan of that, candles. Or I'm not rich enough. Um, love yourself. <laughs> Ah, it smells wow. wow. You see? Like, this okay, is, please, mom, please. I, I choose one. Perfume, mama, candle. Yeah. Why candle <laughs> no, well, you gotta be like that? I can eat three. By the way, I'll come and buy one of okay, these. <laughs> Next time. Uh, well, your money. Money. You can use your money for the money. The in the card. My card is at home. Mm. You can ah, yeah. you just want me to pay uh, you back. How much are those? Yeah. Okay, let me. It smells nice. Yeah. Okay, let's compare with a different one. I love this. Mm. Oh, that's nice. That's better. This is even better. Especially for your for for your taste. Let me see what's up. Color candles. You want candles. Which one is the sweetest? You ain't getting any gun. 
You want something strong? Mm. The last one. And the other one. Laura, what do you think? God, this is sweet. Then take it. I am paying to the night lotion. I am paying to the fragrance. See ya. Here we go. 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 I think it's this one, Laura, the floral one. Oh, it was which one? This one. Yeah. You have sat on my tablet. Huh? Sat on my tablet. Oh, it stopped singing. Yeah. Ethan ataku. Huh? I'm not to tap it up as a baby. Ethan, Ethan, Ethan ataku. They also sell tablets. Ethan ataku Maliza. We won't even go. Ethan ata jam hadi mshanga. Like this DJ. Let's sit there. I, I, now I want a, a perfume, mm -hmm. a nice perfume, not very expensive, just there, but a very nice strong perfume. Okay. Amen. Yeah. Hmm? Amen. Well, can I just yeah, go I saw this being posted the other day. Mm -hmm. It smells like another girl, mm -hmm. and I don't like her. What? <laughs> Let me smell. Let me. I, let me see if I know this girl. Okay. You thought I don't know? How do you know this is a perfume? I'm very observant. How do you know this is how she? Because they like coming to our house. Never, you've never met her like that. I know, but I know. But this is her scent. But then you don't. Okay, she's the only person. Okay, not the only person. She's one of the people. That is my friend of me. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> done with shopping and the day we're gonna try on these outfits we bought i bought some for my baby girl and i'm trying to make better food and a chain sit something you want to make it in new year and then i and then i bought two dresses of mine i'm gonna try them on for you see you're turning the price and then we'll do an unboxing of everything we did today uh, so as i was telling you i have been going through stress and it escalated, it became depression. I had a hormonal imbalance issue. You know, when you have hormonal imbalance, it's easy to, to get, like things to get complicated quickly. So I was stressed, uh, I wasn't sleeping. Um, so the hormonal imbalances became um, kind of like depression, but uh, it, it was hyperthyroidism at first and all that then i did my surgery so i'm becoming better now that i'm back i hope i won't be going anywhere but uh we are together let's pray for each other guys if you believe in god if you believe in allah if you believe in whatever you believe in just uh know that it's part of life like uh, going through um, stress and even depression is part of life i think um, mental illness uh, and mental and mental imbalances should 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 uh, they're really really like affecting people right now and i believe something should be done about it that's why i decided to come out to my followers and just tell you like i've been going through it but now that i'm back i hope uh, i won't be going anywhere for long uh, anytime soon i hope i'll be regular i'm gonna try start posting twice a week uh, starting on saturday i'll be trying to post saturdays and uh, when and thursdays or wednesdays either saturdays and thursdays saturdays and wednesdays at um five o'clock in the afternoon yeah so keep up with me keep up with my life through that uh, if you're one of the people who has been uh, through stress depression don't feel ashamed of yourself don't don't feel like you're out of the world or or it's abnormal no just find treatment don't let it also escalate to the point that it's out of hand don't do anything to harm yourself don't self-harm um just find a way i know that the, the world is so tough right now like even jobs uh, joblessness um the the cost of living it's driving people mad relationships all that is accumulating and becoming really really like getting into people's heads huh? 
but don't don't let it really put you to that point where you're very much down just try get out of it get out of that uh, that situation and you'll be better we are praying for each other whoever follows me i appreciate it if you're here for the first time i appreciate you guys don't forget to like and subscribe help me grow uh, we are living in tough times we are trying out ways to make ends meet kindly don't forget